Hey, what's up? And thanks so much for joining me today for this money moment. Sometimes in life, we, we just don't know what to do. And whether that's with our, our family, whether sometimes that's in our faith, uh, but more often than not, it's, it's in our finances. We, 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 we know where we want to go. We want to be able to pay the bills. We want to have some margin so that we can maybe take a vacation and, and get out of debt. But, but we don't know how to get there. We, we know what we want, but we don't know how to actually get it. We're, we're lacking what scripture calls wisdom, not just knowledge, but wisdom. And today what I want to talk to you about is, is this. Scripture says in Proverbs 4, 7, that the beginning of wisdom is this. Get wisdom. Though it cost all you have, get understanding. And, and, and Scripture says that you and I, when we need wisdom, in the book of James it says, Ask the Lord and He will give you liberally wisdom. But you and I need to go out and get it. We, we, we need to, to search for it. And when it comes to financial wisdom, there's number one, there's the Word of God. Jesus talks about money. The Psalms talk about money. Proverbs talk about money. There, there, there are so many biblical principles and wise statements about money in the Bible. You need to be searching the scriptures for what the Bible says about money. But there are also, there, there's two books for, for my life and Veronica's life personally that we have read that, that's based solely in scripture that have absolutely given us what we needed when it comes to our personal finances. It gave us what we were lacking. It gave us wisdom. And here are the two books that I want to encourage you to go out and get. It's, they're, they're probably going to cost you anywhere from $15 to $22 each. But get wisdom. Though it costs all you have, though it costs you 20 bucks, go out and get these two books. Read them because when you do, you'll get wisdom. Here's the two books. The first one, it's called The Total Money Makeover by Dave Ramsey. Veronica and I, several years ago, we purchased this book, we read this book, we applied this book, and now we understand way more than we used to how money works how God works with money, and now we are able to walk. We're not rich by any stretch of the imagination, but we are able to walk with peace in our heart as it pertains to finances. The Total Money Makeover by Dave Ramsey is a must read for you. The second book that I want you to go out and get is simply called The Blessed Life. It's by a pastor named Robert Morris. This is the single most inspirational and informational book on money, how it works, that I've ever read. I would put it right up there with the Total Money Makeover. This is also a must, must read for you. It's called The Blessed Life by Robert Morris. And so in today's money moment, what I wanna encourage you to do is get wisdom. Even if you got to go out and buy a book or two, get wisdom. Because when you get wisdom, you're going to get what you were lacking. And that's the knowledge to know how to actually get to where you want to get to financially. I sure hope you've enjoyed today's Money Moment. Now go out, go to Amazon.com, go to your Bible bookstore and pick up those two books today. God bless. We'll talk to you next time.